Hey guys, Takara here and welcome to my very cold room. <laughs> my heating is still broken and I am frozen. But the show must go on. We're on Buffy season one, episode six today. And I cannot wait to see what it has in store for us. I want to laugh at more fashion, please and thank you. The tech as well would be a bonus. And, you know, maybe some meaningful character connection. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> but mainly I'm just here to jam out to the theme tune. Anywho, please remember I have a Patreon where extended and exclusive videos over on there and I would love if you could check it out guys, it would mean the world. But without further ado, let's get stuck into it and roll that intro. Here we go. Sunnydale Zoo. Do you ever wonder why nobody cool ever wants to hang out with you? <laughs> just thankful. Do you ever question how you have people to hang out with? Careful. <laughs> she might beat you up. People like this actually exist in the world and it blows my mind. Buffy! You missed it! But also people like this, which is great. It was like the Heimlich with stripes. <sighs> hey Kyle, so is this like a uh, family reunion? <laughs> oh, I don't like his face. Quit it. Mm -hmm. huh? Hey, what are you doing? Lance? They weren't doing anything. Ugh. They think that's going to help him, but really, they're just going to continue to do it. Come on, we're going to check out the hyena house. Don't trust but them. But I think it's off limits. And therein, my friend, lies the fun. It's like he's trying to be the main dude from Cruel Intentions, and it's just not working for him. He is no Ryan Philippe, you know what I mean? What are Kyle and his buds doing with Lance? Oh, playing with him as a cat plays with a mouse. Yeah, well, I better extract Lance oh, before. I'll handle it. This job doesn't require actual slaying. You don't think we should follow? Definitely do. Why don't we? Yeah, why don't we? Yeah. <laughs> are you blind or are you just illiterate? Oh, well, we were just going to You're gonna not going in there. Anyone that does is in a world of trouble. A few hyenas have walked in there already. <laughs> oh, he thinks he's being a part of it. This is just sad. They're going to... They're going to hurt you, my friend. Get out while you can. I don't see any hyenas. OK. Now we've seen it. <laughs> looks cute. I think it looks hungry. <laughs> Not funny. Why should I so in your own species? What, are you going to get in my face? <laughs> That looks sick. <laughs> he, at least he's safe. <laughs> okay. Here they are. Oh, back in bronze, where the magic and the tragic happens. Did he seem upset at all on the bus back from the zoo? Willow looks different. But then again, I'm not as hyper aware of him as, oh, say, for example, you. He makes my head go tingly. You know, oh. I dimly recall, but it hasn't happened too lately. Yes, every time Angel rocks up. Come on, Angel pushes your buttons. I suppose some girls might find him good looking. Just some. If they have eyes. All oh, right, he's a honey, <laughs> but it's just, he's never around and I just can't have a relationship. There he is. Angel? Xander. Oh, he looks totally different. Hungry. Help yourself, Sander. What's up with you? Is something wrong? Did I do something? What could you possibly do? That's crazy talk. Did he just sniff? And the weird behavior award goes to... Oh, and the pack has now arrived. It's the winged monkeys. Hyenas, actually. So he's under the leader of the pack. And I thought it would have been this douche here. Still could be. Right. That's enough training for one day. 
think you've tired Giles out. You just run along to class. I think he needs a cup of tea. To return to my arms. <laughs> Oh. Gave Mr. Oh. quite a scare, didn't he? How adorable. Meet Herbert, our new mascot for the Sunday Night Razorbacks. He's so cute. He is cute. It's funny that people were screaming and running away from the cutest little pig ever. The bisector of a vertex is the line that divides the angle at that vertex into two equal parts. You've lost me, Willow. Why do I need to learn this? Because otherwise you'll flunk math. Do you have a headache? Yeah, I think I know what's causing it. <laughs> Look, forget it, okay? I don't get it. I won't ever. The problem is you kids today have no school spirit. I want to hold the pig. <laughs> that was a red flag and you shouldn't ignore it, Buffer. All regular gym classes have been postponed. Dodgeball. Dodgeball. I wish we had dodgeball. <laughs> All right, Xander. Calm yourself. Teacher had nothing to say during that. Good, this game is brutal. <laughs> Just enjoying the show. Oh, Willow's here by by Xander being all aggressive. What's wrong with you? I guess you've noticed that I've been different around you lately. Yes. He's not gonna be mean. I think it's because my feelings for you have been changing. And well, we've been friends for such a long time. Then I feel like I need to tell you something. Don't you dare, Sander. Oh, I won't be needing your math help anymore, which means I won't have to look at your pasty face again. <laughs> <laughs> I felt like he was talking to me then, and it, it hurt my soul a bit. You gonna say something to me? <laughs> <laughs> that was horrible. I know it's not actually Xander, but it was still horrible for Willow to go through that. They're not going to eat the pig. Let's do lunch. <laughs> no. Sure this rain won't last, it falls on Job's they didn't do anything to him then. You can hear from there. We haven't always been close, but he's never... I think something's wrong with him. Or maybe there's something wrong with me. No, never! I don't know. Maybe three isn't company anymore. We better not see her cry a lot, because I don't think I can handle that. Something's going on. Something weird. What are you going to do? I talk to the expert on weird. So I'm just taken to teasing the less fortunate. Uh-huh. Well, otherwise all his spare time spent lounging about with imbeciles. It's bad, isn't it? Sounds like a teenage boy. He's turned into a 16-year-old boy. Of course, you'll have to kill him. <laughs> of course, you'll have to kill him. Testosterone is a great equaliser. It turns all men into morons. He will, however, get over it. Not overnight like that, though. He scared the pig. Well, he did. Buffy, boys can be cruel. They prey on the weak. It, it, it's... What did you just say? They prey on the weak? They prey on the weak. Xander has been acting totally wiggy ever since we went to the zoo. You're saying that uh, Xander's becoming a hyena? Or been possessed by one? Not just Xander, all of them. Herbert, they found him. The pig? Dead. And also eaten. Testosterone, huh? <laughs> Why couldn't Xander be possessed by a puppy or, or some ducks? I love her. <laughs> so what happens to the person once the spirit's in them? I gotta find Xander. I mean, that doesn't look good, does it? <laughs> it 
it's weird that the cages are ripped apart when they could have just opened the door to it. Behind you! This is ridiculous. We need to talk. Oh. Been waiting for you to jump my bones. <laughs> what is it with you people? Could you? They're not gonna hurt the principal. Get off of me. Is that what you really want? Uh, yeah, I think it is. That is it! <laughs> you kind of outnumbered, lad. Alexander, I don't want to hurt you. This must be horrible for Buffy as well, because she loves Willow. She doesn't feel the same way about Xander than he does for her. And she knows how much Willow likes him. They kill the principal? Well, that I didn't expect. Maybe scare him a bit, but... Oh my god, Xander, what happened? I hit him. With what? A desk. I don't to hold him. They ripped through that cage that the pig had. What makes that different? And the door didn't look strong. They were sent to the principal's office. Good, that'll show them. They didn't hurt him, did they? They, uh... Ate him. They have? They have killed the principal? They ate Principal Flutie? Giles, how do we stop this? How do you transpossess someone? There is some talk of a, a predatory act. What we need to do is put the hyena back in the hyena. Maybe he didn't quarantine those hyenas because they were sick. Oh, wait, somebody's got to watch Xander. I will. On your own? She better be all right. Ugh, thank God. Willow. How are you feeling? You guys got me locked up now. It's faking. Were things a lot simpler when it was just you and me? Don't you fall for this, Willow. Look, I want you to help me. I am helping you. Buffy's trying to help you too. And I wanted to be here to see if you were still you. Not right now. Not right now, he's not. Don't bat your eyelashes at her. Now I know. The students have been possessed by the hyenas? Yes. Now they had rituals for taking the hyena spirits. Well, but we know that it involves predatory act and some kind of symbol. I think we may have enough information so that together we could pull off a reverse transpossession. Can this guy be trusted though? They will track the missing member of their pack until they find him. Willow. They're already on the case. Willow. I'm not listening. Great. I swear to God, if anything happens to Willow. Willow. Xander, shut up. <laughs> they sound like chimpanzees. Hide, Willow. Hide in the best hiding spot you've ever thought of. Oh, they can just sniff her out though, can't they? the best one, Willow. Not the best one. I can't believe that worked. Oh, it didn't work. It did not work. I can't believe that didn't make me jump. Yes, Buffy! And they somehow had to lure them back to the zoo now. We must lead them back to the zoo if we're going to stop this. And before their next meal, you guys go to the zoo and I will bring them to you. <laughs> Tell me the kid is still in the car, right? Didn't your mom teach you? Don't play with your food. <laughs> you know what you want. And I bet she's got boots on, again. Because they never wear suitable suitable footwear in these shows. Uh, he must be inside. I'll go in and prepare things. Um, maybe don't go in there and prepare things. He's going to take one look at that hyena now and he's going to get bleeding turned as well. Or the zookeeper went in and got turned. Doctor? Or he's the, the true pack leader. Oh. What is that? The, uh, 
Are you uh, otherwise prepared for the transpossession? Almost. Sacred circle. Yeah. But this would be here when, when the children first came. Why would you? You can't be trusted, can you? Come on, Giles. How terribly frustrating for you that a bunch of school children could accomplish what you could not. It bothered me, but the power will be mine. Oh, I kind of felt that then. Right in the gut. Where's Giles? He's laying in wait. I'm going to need your help. Oh, Willow! What is this? Now you ask, what is this? You'll pretend to slash my throat and, and, and put the evil in the hyenas? Something like that. Puppy, it's a trap! You by your son! Oh, thank God, Sander. I wonder if he's got his memories. Threw him in with the pack. Uh, did I miss anything? Looks like he's just come back from a good time. <laughs> it shouldn't be too hard to find a new principal. Unless they ask what happened to the last one. Okay, but I had nothing to do with that, right? All right. You only ate the pig. I ate a pig? Was he cooked and called bacon, or...? The outfits, like, they're so good. I didn't do anything else. Did I around you guys anything embarrassing? Nah. <laughs> I cannot find anything anywhere about memory loss afterwards. Did you tell them that? Your secret dies with me. Shoot me. Okay. me. Mount me. So he's literally faking it so he doesn't have to admit to anything. Well, that's nice of Giles, you know. That one to me was a bit hilarious. The effects in that one, yes then. <laughs> the green eyes, the noises, specifically like the audio in this one tickled me funny bone, it really did. So the thing that I took from this though, more than anything, was the relationship between Willow and Xander and Buffy as well to an extent because clearly Willow is infatuated with Xander. It's going to be difficult for Buffy because Xander has those same feelings but towards her, not Willow. Buffy knows this but it's not an easy thing to discuss is it really? I just hope that Willow's heart remains safe, you know, I don't want it to get crushed in any way. With Xander, he's very open with his feelings though as well. And I think Willow knows that. Maybe Xander will come around and realize that he's extremely lucky to have Willow in his life. I guess we'll have to wait and see. But for Buffy, I think she's more interested in Angel and she doesn't really like to admit it because she doesn't know much about him and she wants to focus on you know being a slayer and just being a teenage girl and i think when it comes to angel it's very serious all the time whenever he shows up it's very like she said they just talk about vampires and i think it might be his mystery that's holding her intrigue again I could be very wrong. I don't really know anything about the show just yet. But usually when someone's really mysterious and then you get to know them a little bit, it can sometimes work, but then it's that mystery that keeps things, you know, interesting. So yeah, I guess we'll see. <laughs> Uh, Giles still cracks me up, he really does. The The relationship between Giles and the kids at school as well, I think he's only getting stronger. He care, he can tell he cares deeply about the kids, he doesn't want any harm to come to them in any way. And we didn't hear anything about, you know, the, the big vampire that's in his lair right now, angry, the fact that his plan has failed yet again. But he does have this child that we didn't see in this one, so I predict that that whole arc is going to be the build up to the end of this season, like season one. I'm assuming he will be the, the big bad for the majority of the season and then we'll get these monster of the weeks throughout with baddies in it then, like this zookeeper guy. It was a good twist with the zookeeper being 
the one that wanted the power and then the kid's just doing something that he's been trying to do all this time. I realised that the moment Willow was getting tied up or in danger in any way, I'm just like, no, it's a firm no from me, she better be okay. So that is telling me that Willow has already got my heart to be fair so if my characters like the ones that i'm drawn to more so change will be interesting but as of now i think it's looking like willow is more my gal i'll have to wait and see again it, these are so fun they're so fun to watch like obviously you guys have seen them and i don't know when let me know if it was like when it aired back in the day or if you binged it later on like i'm doing now but for me it's a change something that is in the wheelhouse of what i usually watch but it has that like nostalgic vibe and i'm finding myself captivated when i'm watching it so let me know what your experiences was like did you end up watching a few and thinking this isn't for me but powering through and then loving it or were you just a fan straight away like share your thoughts because i'd love to read them if you like this reaction though please give this video a cheeky thumbs up it really helps me to know that you're enjoying what you're seeing and subscribe to the channel if you'd like to but as always there's no pressure here i have a patreon where extended and exclusive videos over there as well so if you want to binge these reactions but in the fuller form check it out guys i live stream on twitch as well every friday and saturday i do gaming on a friday and just chatting on a saturday and sometimes more in between as well if i can so check it out and i hope to see you all again soon for the next reaction thanks for watching guys bye